Hey, Anoka Tornadoes fans, we are here live at the National Sports Center, joining our game in just underway here between the Anoka Tornadoes U13 and TCU. Indoor soccer action here in Blaine, Minnesota. Jaden taking the corner kick. He dumps that one in. One comes out. Jaden tries to center that one, get it across. TCU recovers. May shoot that out. Mason. About to send that one in. No, Sam takes the kick in. Nope, and indoor soccer, a little bit different rules. We have a kick in instead of a throw in. Pass up to Rick. Rick back to Hunter. Hunter dumps that one in with that big boot. Goalie lets that one go outside for the goalie kick. Goalie sends that one out. Rick intercepts it. Tries to get that one out. Sam picks it up. Up to Rick. Rick forced off the ball. Just about said puck. Rick forced off the ball. Didn't quite get that shot off. Ball goes off Jaden. TCU to kick it in. Kick across, just beyond Rick's foot. Hunter blocks that one. Hunter dumps it up for Rick again. Much smaller field here in indoor soccer. Hunter with that big boot, remember from last year, dumps that one in, goal grabs it. He sends that one down. Mason tries to get that one. Bicycle kick by number five. He's got a break on. Shoots it across. Picks the far corner. Goes out. Eli playing goal today for uh, Henry. Isn't here. Tough one these days for the Tornadoes. Because of spring break, there's been a lot of uh, a lot of players missing. There, Rick tries to beat his man. And he goes down, ball goes out, and Tornado's to kick in. Rick sends it back to Hunter for the kick. Hunter looks, sends it in, almost up to Rick. The 21 clears that one out. Jaden chases it back, pass it back to Mason. Mason almost gets back, Hunter back checking. He gets bumped off, that's gonna get called. Hunter gets the kick. Draws the penalty on that one. Eli, the goalie, stepping in to kick. He and Sam had collided. He went down and head hit turf. We always hate to see that. is out to do the concussion protocol on him. Well, happy St. Patrick's Day to our viewers at home. Number 21 gets up and walks off the turf under his own steam. Good to see that. Definitely got his bell rung. Jaden takes the kick. Boots out right on the net. That one goes up. Keeper bobbles that for a bit, gobbles it up. Keeper sends that one in. Hunter wow, wails that one back to him. Goes off a green foot over there. And Hunter grabs that one in the corner. On the side, pardon me. Hunter kicks that in to Sam. Jaden picks up the rebound. One goes out. Off TCU player. Jaden with a kick. He boots that one up. That one goes out. A little English on that one and just missed the net. He was going for that top corner. Keeper rolls that one in. Rick tries to pick it up. 
Rick gets it. Balls back. Hard pass up. Picked up. And Hunter, way over on the other side. Tries to send that one across. Rick, couple of moves. He's got two men on. Hunter, big boot up. And fair catch there called by the goalie. Nice job by the keeper to gobble that one up. It's kind of a hard to judge shot there. Sunny and 72 inside. <laughs> Sunny and 52 outside. Rick sends that one back to Mason. That goes off the chest. That's going to leave a mark. Mason's got it. Boots it in. That one's up to Rick. Rick with the move to get that one through, but keeper uh, beat him to it. one nothing TCU. This point in the game. We're just well underway into the first half. Hunter with the kick. Looks up field, sends it for Rick. Rick trying to get that one. Comes back. Rick gets it looking to sneak that one through the TC player's five hole. He sends that one up. Another breakaway. Eli, nice little play. The TCU player sends that one out the back. Scopes things out. Big throw up to right up to midfield. We've got Caden has come in now. Replace Rick. Ball's back. Hunter's got that one. We've also got Odie and Landon out there. TCU player kicks that one in. Goes off Hunter and out. TCU kick. Dangerous one from the sidelines. Cross kick, but he uh, sends out one wider than that. And Eli. Picks that one up. Looks up field. Big boot. That goes out. TCU with a kick. For 44. Puts that one into play fairly quickly. Goes off Landon and out. A few more subs here today than there was last time. Caden trying to outrun two defenders. He brings that back, shoot, scores! Caden ties the game at one. Nice move, fights off two defenders, gets the ball, boots it past the goalie. And we are knotted at one. Caden with that nice move. Land a nice move. Odin fires that one up. All the way to the keeper. Keeper dumps that one up. Hunter's got it. He sends that one into orbit. <laughs> Off the back wall, that is out. Goalie plays that one in. Nice jump by Landon. One of the taller players on the team. He gets a hit on that one that goes out. That one sent all the way up. Goalie dumps that one back. Tie back there. Some of the other uh, defensemen uh, came in on that last change. Hunter dumps that one up for Caden. Caden's got an opportunity again. Note that there's no offsides in called in indoor soccer. So it's... TCU trying to move that one up to 23. It was just up at midfield. A lot of the game's been played on this side of the field. Ty elects to dump that one out. Sends that one out, out of bounds. Effectively a corner kick from that angle, even though it wasn't, uh, wasn't technically a corner kick. Eli looks upfield. Up 
to Ty. Ty dumps that one up for Landon. Odie up for Caden. Possession back and forth. Caden muscles his way through. Nice move to get that ball. He's up. He shoots. Oh, just wide of the net. Great opportunity by Caden. He made his own luck on that play. But goalie had committed, but Caden couldn't quite get the ball past him. Score still one to one. Landon comes up, shoots that one, forced outside by number 44. The goalie sends that one up. TC attacks. Caden, who's been on fire this game, grabs the ball. He's still got it. Sidelines. Pardon me. That one goes outside. Uh, out of bounds. TCU kicks. Big kick in. All the way through to uh, Ty. Landon brings it up. Sends it. Hunter boots that one up. Hunter's got that monster kick of his. He's able to move that ball pretty much down the whole field. In fact, two games ago we saw Henry, who was playing goal for that game, boot the ball and actually score on the other team. Not often you see a goalie score in soccer. Ball way up. Caden's got it still loose, but the goalie hangs on. Nice kick into play by Ty. Ball goes way up. Eli decides he's not going to mess around. And he bounces that up, goes off a TCU player's face and doesn't clear the zone. But ball goes out. And Eli's going to play that one. TCU looking uh, mighty sharp in their green uniforms for St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> Eli's wearing green today, too. Ball up, goes off Landon's foot. And of course, Anoka in their very nice maroon uniforms. Introduced the style in the uh, summer season last year. Ball up, and that's called as a handball on Caden. Trying to play that one off his head, but missed his head. Number nine for TCU. Launches it in. Ty with a pretty decent boot, too, and he clears that one out. <clears throat> TCU dumping that one way in. That's going to go out of bounds. With these much smaller fields, a little more difficult for the players to deliver those change-ups that go just to the right uh, part of the field to pass to their own players. Caden, some nice moves there. Brings that one up. TCU moving the ball up. Hunter's back out there. He sends her up to Caden. Caden across the landing and oh, just goes out of bounds. TCU, camera works a little different in this uh, the size of field as well. A little harder to keep things on the action than uh, regular soccer. There's uh, Odie back to Ty. Mason way back. Sends that one to Eli. Eli sends it up to Ty. Ty up to Landon. Landon holds it in. That one's up to Caden. Caden with the opportunity. He shoots. Oh, goalie just got his fingertips on that one before it made the net. Great play. Caden to make that play and the goalie to dive and just take away the corner. Corner kick by Caden. Oh, Ty is going to go all the way across the field to take that one. He's playing D on the other side of the field. Looking for the kick. He sends that one across. Low kick. Landon comes back. And gets sent across. Number 30 with the opportunity. He crosses it. Mason is right there. And 
Anoka clears it out. Ty sends it in. Nothing goes down. A little bit of a trip up. And that gets called for a penalty kick. And he gets that one. That's going to be a point blank penalty shot. <clears throat> TCU forming the wall. <clears throat> Big, oh, nasty kick, number five. Took one off the face a little early. <laughs> his uh, massaging his shoulder, that went. That was a hard kick, went off him, out of bounds. Corner kick by Ty. Took the last corner kick right on, and the goalie grabs that one. Sends it up. Caden with the opportunity. Oh! Tries to get one by the goalie, but goalie hangs on to that one. Another opportunity, still 1-1. Thirty sending that one in. Off to Mason, that one goes all the way back to Eli. Eli sees Landon way up here. He sends that one in. That's out on the other side. Jaden watching that one. Hunter, Odie, Sam, and Rick waiting on the bench. It's back to Mason. That goes out off Mason's boot, and that's going to be a TCU corner kick. <clears throat> Jaden with a break. He sends that one up to Caden. Up to Landon. Landon shoots. Oh! He was just a little bit too nice deep to get a good boot on that one. Great hustle by Anoka. Our tornadoes to get that one all the way up there. Caden fighting for it. That one goes out of bounds. TCU ball. TCU sends it up. Jaden Hull grabs onto that one. Gets a little bit of a push. All the way back, Ty runs back for it. He gets a little pushing and shoving, a little uh, prelude to the uh, summer season where it's going to get rougher and rougher. Landon holds it in, keeps it in play. Number five who helps him to the turf. Comes by to check and make sure Landon's okay. Lethal penalty kick here from point blank. Taken by Ty. Ty's looking for that. Oh, that goes off number 44 and out. So that will be an Anoka corner kick. Ty getting a lot of work. He boots that one in. That one goes, oh, right in front of the net. Off of 44's head. That's going to hurt. And the ball goes out of bounds. Ty's going to kick that one in here. More work for Ty. Big boot. That one gets blocked. Ty with a couple of nice moves. Goes all the way. Sure, what the call was on that. Oh, might have been a penalty kick on uh, after Ty has helped to the turf. <clears throat> and that is a penalty shot. This rule here is he kicks it, and as soon as he kicks it, it's live. So all the players on their marks, getting ready to grab that ball. Tyler kicks it. Goalie gets that one. Goals are much smaller than in uh, summer outdoor soccer, so uh, it's a little tougher to score on a penalty kick like that. Mason way over there on the far side to take the penalty kick. He sends that one in. Goes up to 23 on the weak side. He shoots that one, that one. Goes harmlessly out of bounds. 1-1 the score. 
about 21 minutes into the game. Eli with a big shot up intended for Rick. He was he's just nicely back on the field with Sam. Those fresh legs. Mason, nice move to break up that rush there. Sam back to Ty. Ty back up to Sam. Just a little bit of passing here. Sam beats his man. Brings it up to Sam. Up to Jaden. Jaden tries to hold on to that one. Sends it up. <clears throat> Ball comes deep into the TCU territory, and they rush back. Goes off Mason, and that's out. TCU sends that one into play. Jaden working on that one. Oh, Mason with that sweet kick. Kicked her up and way up into the air. Ty sends it up to Sam. Sam trying to control that one. Rick comes back to support. Ty grabs onto that one. He sends it up to Rick. Rick dumps it out. TCU with a kick in. Jaden tries to grab that one. Oh, Mason gets that one in the face. He shakes that one off. That was a nasty one. We've seen some uh, pretty wicked ball shots and hitting people in painful places this game. Jaden sends it up to Rick. Rick with a race with the goalie comes up. Nasty game of chicken there. Nobody backed down. Jaden sends it across. Oh, just past the boot of Rick. And out of bounds. Good pressure by Anoka here. Hunter, Josh playing with the possession. Tries to get that one. Sends that one goes uh, back into TCU territory. Rick tries to pick the pocket. Hunter grabs that one. Sends it for Rick. Rick with a nice move. Beats one player. Oh, he was trying to pass one across for Sam. Didn't quite get it there. Rick back to Ty. Hunter boots that one in. But one of the TCU players making a break for it. Number 23 on this side. Hunter gets the kick. It's in. Ty's got that one. Ty up for Sam. Ty keeps it in. Sam with a shot right on the goalie. A lot of pressure, a lot of shots for Anoka. Kind of dominating the game. We're, we uh, wound up on this side of the field because there really wasn't anywhere else where to sit on the far side of the field. And so we're seeing a lot of the action. The downside of that is in the second half, if Anoka continues to dominate, we won't, uh, we'll be looking at the action all the way down at the far end. Hunter, up for Rick. Back to Hunter, sends it to Rick. Rick moves it through. He's all alone, he shoots. Goalie gets out another shot for Noka. We're not tracking shots in this game, but uh, definitely a vantage. And it's in Anoka's favor today. Hunter the offsides kick it's up to Sam number 23 he picks that one up Sam pressures him gives up the ball TCU recovers trying to bring that one in 43 gets pickpocketed by Hunter Hunter sends it out for Rick just past him TCU sends it in Ty comes Bursting through. TCU floating a player over on the weak side all alone. You see over there by the net. TCU boots it in. But they just can't seem to get that ball up to their weak side uh, winger. Oh, Jaden comes in. Jaden's got the opportunity. Tries the move. He goes down. Rick comes in. He hangs on to that one. Rick moving it up. Number nine elects to send out one. 
Take the corner kick. Probably his best opportunity there, just to break up that play. Rick's got it. Looking for his player to kick up to. Rick kicks it in. Jaden's got it. Hunter with a big boot. Oh, number 60, the goalie, the diving attempt at a save. The shot was just wide, but he's uh, kept his team in it this game. And that is the half. 26 minutes past the hour of four. And we are still knotted at one. A little frustrating for Anoka. The TCU goalie has done a great job of just keeping his team in this game. Stopped a lot of shots. Eli, who's occasionally plays goal, stepping up and covering for Henry, who's not here this, uh, this game. Missing Henry's dad, uh, too, who is uh, Justin, who is going to come and do uh, color commentary, but I'm all alone today. Good fan showing. Lots of parents from both teams. Hello to our one viewer at home. We are going to pause the broadcast while I take a drink of coffee and we will see you in about uh, five minutes. <coughs> and we are back. Jaden takes the face off, sends it to Eli, back to Hunter. Hunter passes that one up to Caden. Uh, Not Jaden, Caden. Goes off a TCU head and harmlessly over the box. Send that one back. Caden's got that one in the corner. A few nice little moves. Real showcase we've, as we've uh, followed this team over the last year or so they've uh, their footwork has uh, gotten really amazing it's fun to watch some of the the foot tricks that those guys do there's our resident celebrity ben member of the board former uh, coach of this team odie tries to put that one in that comes all the way back to landon landon Fires it up all the way up to Caden. Caden's got that one. Nice foot moves. He shoots. Oh, goalie. Continuing a strong play. Grabs that one. TCU attacking back there at midfield. Comes up. And they keep on keeping somebody on the weak side. Big TCU shot. That one goes up and over the net. That might have been a goal during the summer season the larger nets that the U13s play with. Big throw up by Landon. Nice throw. Caden gets it. And a repeat of that play about a 45 seconds ago. Tries to cross it. Goes off a TCU player and Eli takes the corner kick. Eli with the corner. He sends it out. Shallow. TCU gets a hold of that one. They try and clear that. Eli gets it. Keeper winds up with it. He sends it up for Hunter. Hunter and Caden's got the opportunity. Oh, Deeks the goalie, but the, can't quite get the, keep the handle on that ball and it goes out of bounds. Goalie throws it in. Hunter's got that one. Another difference in indoor soccer is that the, uh, oh, number 39 gets the opportunity and Landon with a great save. He hauls off and throws that one deep. Eli keeps it in. Mason launches one. So I was going to say another difference between uh, this and outdoor soccer is that uh, 
there's no goalie kicks. The goalie can do whatever they want to put it back into play, and most, most of the time they uh, elect to throw it in. Another opportunity for TCU. He shoots Landon with a great save. Gets a handle on that one. Great play by Landon. Wow! Landon keeps the score tied one to one and another big throw. He should be a quarterback in football. Did he ever haul off? He's got some great throws. Sends him almost three quarters of the length of the field. There's Eli. Eli dumps it up. Save. More pressure by Anoka, way down at the far end of the field. TCU bringing it up. Anoka playing pretty aggressively. Whip. Oh, and Hunter gets uh, banged down. He looks to sub off. He's, could see the grimace on his face, so hopefully he's uh, just has a little bit of a bruise to show for it. Caden with a kick in. Looks, sends it up. That one goes, oh. And you look, we've got some pretty big boots on this team. And Caden's one of those. TCU attacking. Oh, we have a princess over there on the field. Odie boots that one to the side. That one goes up into the stands. Sam grabs onto that one. Ready to kick that one in. He kicks it up. Caden across. Quite to Eli. Odie with a lethal kick there. That one heads out. Caden some nice moves. Brings it almost all the way up. Boots it back. Odie with a... Oh, goes with a chip shot. That one's just a couple of feet over the net. He had that one labeled. 1-1 one, one, Anoka versus TCU. Cody puts it up, far side of the field. TCU tries to get that one. They keep that one in. They're attacking. Number five, who uh, took a couple of shots off the face in the first half. He was looking for the, looking for the pass. Mason passes it up. Cody, number five, Josh going for the ball. Cody gets it past, that one comes up. Caden's on it. TCU keeps it in. Sam battles. Sam goes down and that one goes out of bounds. TCU ball. Nope. And that was penalty called. Sam drew. And Sam gets the uh, gets the kick in. Thought that was a penalty kick, but it's a sideline kick. TCU. Dumps that one back out. Sam gets to do it again. Another uh, five yards up the field. Sam launches that one across. He was looking for Eli. Mason holds the line. Bodie gets that one. Nonchalantly plays that one. Brings it up. <clears throat> Sends that one up. Keeper grabs it. Keeper sending it up. Eli attacking. Rick's back in the field. He's way over on the other side. He gets a shot. Oh, that just goes wider than that. TCU keeper launching it in. Number five, fast legs. He's onto that. Sam boots it up. Finns is all alone with the goalie. Oh, he tries to put the move on the goalie, but the goalie goes in for a sliding little bit of a slide tackle there and the ball goes wide and out. It's Eli away over there for the corner kick. Sends it up. Ty charged in. Tried to play that one. Comes out. Rick's gonna take the kick from the uh, kick in from the side. Still 1-1 despite the best efforts of an Oka. Kickin goes all the way in. TCU will take it. They boot it up. Mason boots it up just past Rick's feet. Ty, who was playing uh, D in the first half, 
Now playing forward. Got a whistle from the ref. TCU with the kick in. Launches it up. Exciting game here today. A lot of pressure by Anoka. TCU lumps that one up. Landon launches that one back up. Nice little one to Rick gets that one. He was going for the dribbler from the looks of it. No, he was trying to pass that one across to Jaden. Jaden didn't quite make it there. The keeper gobbled that one up. Jaden muscling his way through traffic. Ty goes down. Rick hangs on to it. No, nope, that one comes out. Moved by number five, Mason. Nice defensive job. Sends that one out. TCU tries to hold that one in, but play is broken up. TCU kicks. Mason up to Rick. Rick's got one, two men to beat. He takes it all the way up, and he gets dumped to the turf. No call on the play. That one did not go off out of bounds. TCU coach was realized that it hadn't gone out of bounds. It had stayed in miraculously. So uh, Rick got the shot off, stopping over the net. A little bit of confusion on the field there. Goes off Ty's head. TCU kicks it in. Mason with the run back. Now Landon sends that one up. Jaden's bumps and grinds there. Ball goes up, tries to get that one to Rick. Rick with another opportunity. Whistle on the play. Not sure what the call was. That is a penalty kick. <clears throat> Called a foul, I guess. And Jaden taking the kick. Rick standing right on the near post. Kick goes in. Oh! Keeper makes a miraculous save there. Ty had the opportunity there. We're just going to move the tripod to keep from getting taken out by the uh, by the ball. Ball goes all the way out. Sam brings it up, brings it up for the kick in. Sam, big boot, goes up. Oh, number nine joins the number five face club as he takes the ball off the kisser. Ty with the ball. Pass it up to Rick. Rick, shot, gets uh, blocked. That player taking a couple of shots in that play. Mason all the way back. Landon boots that one up. He's got a good leg in addition to that good arm. Mason and Sam both trying to play that one. It made it all the way back. Mason gets the handle on it. Ball goes out of bounds and TCU with the kick in. They elect to kick back to the D. Back up. Jaden breaks that one up. Sam muscles his way through coverage. He goes in. Passes that one up. He had Rick and Jaden but couldn't quite get it through to them. Sam with uh, another player with some nice moves. Landon comes oh. up. Oh, somehow. <laughs> Landon kicked that one, went off a face, kind of came loose. Rick with the sh opportunity. Goalie saves that one. And that one goes out of bounds. Great action at both ends now. Exciting game. Both, both teams putting some good pressure on. Anoka still... Uh, Definitely with the uh, with the upper hand here, but they haven't been able to put that one in. Rick back to Sam. Sam tries to bring that one in. Rick's got it. Passes it up to Jaden. Jaden's got it. TCU clears that one out. Sam races back, takes that one away from the weak side winger. Same player with the pig tip. Landon watches that one. You were watching 
Anoka Tornado Indoor Soccer here at the National Sports Center in Blaine, Minnesota. One all tie. Eli with a shot, another save by that goalie. He's just able to cover that net. He's uh, ready for summer soccer. The way he's covering that net. It's going to be a force to rec be reckoned with to uh, in the summer soccer season with the bigger nets. Ty holds it in. Delayed call on that. Ty didn't hold it in. And TCU kicks. Tie game. We have about, about 10 minutes left in this game. Noka keep, continues to apply the pressure, but they just can't seem to get it past that pesky goaltender. Oh, ball is up, goes right past Ty's boot. <laughs> Landon picks that one up. Players of the game of uh, if there were three players of the game, it almost say the three uh, three different players who have played goalie. Eli, when he was in net in the first half, Landon, and the TCU goaltender. Brand new turf here at the National Sports Center Indoor Complex. Got uh, three fields wide here, all going at the same time. Eli kicks it in. Odin with the opportunity, comes back to Eli. Eli, oh, with the cross pass. That one uh, just going all the way through traffic and making it to the far side. Odin with corner kick. Sends that one in. Off a of 30s boot, that was a dangerous play. Sam passed it over to Odin. Off of Odin's boot. Caden gets bumped around there. Caden with some nice footwork. Trying to bamboozle his man. He does. He winds up going down. Caden finally unleashes one after holding on to that ball <laughs> in the corner for a long time. And then finally gets the shot off. But the goalie saves that one. Sam with the ball. Looks, kicks that one into play. That one goes out. Oh, off a nose, and Sam gets to take another shot. Another three, four yards up. Kicks it in. TCU clears that one. It's back to Hunter. Hunter sends it up to Odin. Little bit of showing off here with the head ball. Always kind of fun to watch that one. And that gets called. Must have been a push or a shove that the ref took umbrage with. And Eli gets a very close penalty kick. Wouldn't want to be standing there, the TCU players. Eli with a shot. Oh, missed that top corner by inches. It's a nice shot. It was the play. Odin holds that one in with a good header. TCU not wanting to mess around with Caden. They send that ball out. Caden's got that one at the sidelines. He's got the kick. Looks in. Sends it up and over. And TCU will get the kick. Probably about seven minutes left in this game. 7 to 10, depending on how the ref uh, calls it. TCU clearing the ball way upfield. 4.47 local time here in Blaine, Minnesota. Landon with a sidekick. Hunter covering net, just in case. Landon boots it up. TCU grabs it. They can't hold on to it. Anoka will kick. Eli with a kick. Just a reminder, we don't throw the ball in. Eli with a, another, he was aiming for that same corner on that, uh, that sideline kick. He was aiming for that same corner of the net, but missed it by about the same amount. Hunter, great defensive play. 
Send that one out of bounds. TCU looking to kick. They kick that one up. Landon <clears throat> grabs onto it. Sends it up for Eli. Eli with a break. Beats one man. Beats him again. Ball goes out and Eli will get the corner kick. Eli, what's he going to do? Kicks it short. That one goes off a TCU player, and Eli will get that to do another corner kick. TCU subbing off. Another part of uh, indoor soccer is the subbing is very quick and continuous and done uh, even during the play. Caden holding his man to the outside. Ball comes up. Eli couldn't quite make that. TCU kicks it out. Hunter right up at uh, the center line. What's he going to do? Is he going to try and hit the net from there? He sends it back to Sam. Sam sends it in. Up to Odie. Odie kicks it up. Was right there for Eli. Off Eli's shins and out. Caden back there to Kick that one in. It's a sideline kick. Boots it up. Goes off. Eli with a shot. That one comes way out. Odie's got it. And the ball's out of bounds. Ref calls it a Noka kick. Landon tries to send that one in. Number five stops the ball with his face for a third time this game, third or fourth, and he's going to do it again. Sucker for punishment. Tries to jump up, turns his back this time. Ball goes out off him. Landon gets another shot. Is Landon going to pound this poor kid into next week? Goes off the kid's butt and far enough out now that uh, Landon, after taking three sideline kicks, doesn't get another turn. Eli kicks it, goes off number five's butt, all the way out. S tied at one. Eli with a corner kick now. Sends it up, short kick for Sam. Number five gets that one. Or pardon me, Hunter. Sam's all alone, two on one. Great job by Sam to force that play, take away the two on one. Ball goes out. And TCU with the kick from the sidelines. Chips it up, goes off Hunter's leg. Out of bounds, TCU with another opportunity. Just a little bit deeper this time. Pass it back to the D. Eli goes in to break that one up. TCU holds on. Jaden passes that one up. Big foot race, Caden's got it. Caden with the only goal of the game for the Anoka. Oh, and Eli with the opportunity. Oh, shoots it. That one goes wide. He's going to have nightmares about that one. Oh, handball by number five. I think he was uh, probably just came out of hockey or something in her basketball. And he reached. You saw him reach up, and he instantly regretted it when the ball went off his hands. But he's going to come up there. He must have skin made of iron. Sam chips that one up past him. Goes off an Anoka player all the way out. And TCU moving the ball back up the field. Hard passing here, and they don't quite make it. Number five. Big effort there to make it was just about a foot short. <clears throat> Sam with the bully kick right up and number five's back. Kicks it up and over. Comes up to Rick. Rick hangs on to it. Sends it to Eli. Eli charging in. Beats one, two guys. He's still got it. All the way in. <clears throat> And Sam, fighting number five. Five sends it across. 
Number five, after taking that beating, I don't know how many shots he blocked or attempt to block, gets subbed out. Landon with the sideline kick, dying minutes, probably five to seven minutes left in this game. 1-1 one, one tie. The game will end in a tie without overtime or anything to settle it. Tornado's 1-1 one one in the season. Tough loss last week when everybody was away for spring break. Ty moving in. He's got the ball. Got a whistle. TCU gets the kick. TCU kick way up. Eli stops that one. That ball goes out. TCU with a kick. Hunter sends it up to Rick. <clears throat> Rick back to Hunter. Hunter and Rick were actually hanging out this afternoon at Rick's house. <clears throat> Rick's got that ball. He shoved. He launches that one. Chips it up. Rick scores. Finally beat the goalie. Two to one Anoka. What a play. Booted that one, hit the goalie, got the rebound. Goalie was right in the way, so Rick just uh, lobbed that one up. Got his pitching wedge out to put that one up. And that is the end of the game. Anoka with a last second goal by Rick to finish it off. Great game by both teams. Great game by all three goalies that played in the game. We're gonna step up here and... And we see all the players from TCU come by. Good game, guys, good game, good game, good game. And Anoka. Wins it by a score of two to one. You've been watching Tornado Soccer here, live at the National Sports Center, Blaine, Minnesota. Exciting game with goals by Caden and Rick. Eli and Landon playing net. Did a great job, both of them. This has been Tornado Soccer, live on YouTube. Hey, Rick.